Hello and welcome to South End Today. South End Police were part of a month long crackdown on drugs that saw 53 people arrested. Police from across the county came together in October for Operation Essex. Arrests were made for possession, possession with intent to supply, driving under the influence and more. The aim was to target those involved with drug supply in Essex, as well as associated crimes. Operation Essex has been a massive success with nearly a thousand wraps of Class A drugs seized, including heroin, cocaine and crack cocaine, as well as almost £4,000 in cash. There was good news for Southend's first time buyers as the council unveiled a new shared ownership scheme. It was announced that 52 flats in the new Richmond House development will be available for shared ownership. Richmond House is a key part of Victoria Avenue redevelopment plan and providing affordable housing is vital to that goal. Under the new scheme, homeowners will be able to buy between 25 and 75% of a home's value, paying rent on the rest. Seafront traders have voiced criticism towards Southend Council's plan to use taxpayers' money to create a new car park. The new lot will be developed on the gasworks site on Eastern Esplanade, which the council recently purchased for £7 million. The council hoped to appease the traders by building the new lot to replace the Seaway car park, which is set to be transformed into a leisure complex. Instead, it has angered the traders, as they claim taxpayers should not be footing the bill for these developments. You have been watching South End Today.